Hi, I'm Vicki with My Fine Equine and we're out here in the pretty sun today to uh, show you a couple of our senior horses that we have. We call them senior horses. And uh, we're going to talk about uh, their condition and digestive health and what I like to feed them to keep them looking like this. Um, first, this is our mare Posey. And she is uh, very patiently waiting for her food. They have fly masks on because the flies are still out. It is August. Um, here's her food. We'll talk about her condition here in a bit. I hydrate uh, with a gallon of hot water, a couple of one quart scoops of alfalfa pellets, and that's her hay ration in the morning. And then uh, the other bucket is a feed mix that I make, which is on my website. And then you see the tiny pellets that are on top there. It is a digestive supplement top dress that I use on all of my horses. And that is a four ounce scoop there for Posey. So I'm gonna pour her food in there real quick. And then we'll start talking about some other things. And I just put it in the same feeder, so I'm going to put the alfalfa pellets in the bottom. And then I'm just going to put the rest of her ration on top. And she's going to start eating. I'll introduce you to her son, General, here. <coughs> here, General. Come here. She's in the shade. We'll have to mm -hmm. bring her back. She, no, she shows up better in here because it's not so glary. She actually has color now. Okay, go ahead. Okay, come up here with General for a second. Okay, I can see General. Okay, this is General, her son. And uh, I usually give him a tiny bit just because it makes him happy what I give her in the morning. And the supplement that I offer for him also comes in a treat size pellet. Okay, we need to get into the shade. It's so glary. Much better light in here for this. Here we go. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on, General. Here. Yeah, I know. Look. Look what I got. Come on. Don't do that. There you go. All right, here, here. All right, these are the treat size pellets of the ABC Plus, and I give that to him in the morning because he doesn't get a grain ration in the morning or a wet feed mix. I'm not actually graining per se. Come on, let's have the rest. There you go. can start with General. Uh, Jim will show you his body condition. This horse actually used to be uh, insulin resistant. We found that out the hard way and we will do a video on that another time otherwise this video will get way too long. <coughs> but as you can see his weight is very good. How long have we had him? Uh, we've had him since he was three weeks old. Yeah. We bought him and his mother at the same time. He is a uh, purebred Polish Arabian. And uh, as you can see, his body condition is great. His feet are great. Uh, he actually does better with his feet a little longer. We keep all of our horses barefoot trimmed. Uh, we don't ride with shoes. They've all been barefoot for, he's been barefoot his whole life. He might have had shoes on his front feet once while in training. See if we can get you out of the corner and him into there, just so we're out of the glare of the light. Get in there, buddy. There we go. <clears throat> and we feed him just Come grass hay. There we go. We feed him just uh, grass hay, as I said, we found out he was insulin resistant uh, the hard way. 
I used to feed all the horses uh, alfalfa grass mix. And uh, there's Mama over there. And we had an incident of foundering. Three out of ten horses foundered. Uh, and they were all three insulin resistant, and I just didn't recognize the signs. So anyway, um, I think he looks really, really great. Uh, if you were to guess his age, um, most people would think he's maybe between 10 and 12 years old, maybe. Uh, we're proud to say General is actually ready for this. He turned 25 in March. Wow. So General is actually 25 years old. And uh, awesome. And we've been feeding him since he was three weeks. Since he was three weeks old. So, he doesn't have any joint issues. Uh, part of my feed mix is feeding uh, amount of flax seed hydrated in their food and uh, it does wonders. Really does wonders along with the ABC Plus Digestive, uh, which, in, which I wholeheartedly believe in. I started using it in 1990. Uh, he was the first horse actually as a three-year-old to get it and um, I have not been off of it since. Everyone has gotten it ever since, any age, any condition, no matter what. So I can't, uh, can't recommend it enough. It's, it's totally gold to me. And there's mom. So Posey here is our other senior horse. for us. Move over. There you go. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> so Posey is a little 14 hand uh, purebred Arabian mare, crab crabbit bred, and she is General's mother. As you can see, her, her body condition is really great. She does have these uh, sarcoids. Uh, they started up when she was all oh, about 15 and uh, the veterinarian said the only thing they could do is surgically remove them, but if you're not going to show the horse, there's really no point because they don't pose uh, any danger. So um, that's all that is. And she could be and General's mother even at the age of like, uh, he's 25, she could have been, uh, what, four when she had him in could've, real life. Could have been. Could have been. Yeah, could have been. But she wasn't. Um, again, on those sarcoids, they happen to, uh, usually to gray horses. Her sire is gray. And, uh, being a light chestnut, that's why they said it probably happened. So anyway, um, this girl's been with me since she was 12. And, uh, I've had her 